All right, what is going on, everybody? I hope everybody is having a great Monday so far. If you're not, then change that, all right? Be positive. Because you want to know why? Because, you know, if I'm positive, I think you guys could be positive. No, I'm just kidding. But I hope everybody had a great Monday. And uh, but I am back with another BO3 <clears throat> cook com. And this is not a live gameplay. This is actually a really good gameplay. I do kind of bad in the beginning. Um, but I do progress. So, I don't know if you guys have me on Twitter or not, but this is actually a live gameplay of, you know, somebody random who sent me a gameplay that I needed. But, anyways, on to the main topic of this video. I hope everyone had a great Thanksgiving. Um, My Thanksgiving was pretty good. I had family over. It's, it was good. But, I'm going to tell you guys a story. I think it's been, like, a little bit of a while since I've told you guys a story, and I feel like I should tell you guys a story. So, this happened um back in... I think fifth grade it was uh we were just getting out of school and everybody was so hyped because it was the day before winter break so we get like three weeks off and we were just so hyped and um so we end up me and my friends were playing in the playground and don't ask how i remember this but this is really weird how i remember this because it was just a nightmare to be honest and uh not only was this weird but it was disturbing. And what I mean by disturbing is that I almost got kidnapped. Literally almost got kidnapped. It was, as I said, day before winter break. And everybody's like, oh, come get your candy. And, you know, get your candy cane. So we went, me and my friends had money. And we ended up going to this table where this lady was selling candy canes for, like, a charity or whatnot. And um, we decided to buy some. And then, all of a sudden, this white truck comes up. And... <laughs> This is the typical pedophile, but all of a sudden this white truck comes up and we get scared of our minds. He stops and he's like, what are you kids doing? And we thought it was like a cop, all right? Because he was kind of dressed like a cop, but we didn't see his badge or like a gun or anything. So like we didn't know what to do. He stopped. He, he was about to get out of his car, but he didn't. And then we said... Like, who are you? We asked, like, if who he was. Maybe it was, like, my friend's dad or something. Because I don't know, like, my friend's parents. I'm not a fucking weirdo. I just noticed, why the fuck is this gameplay so fucking laggy? Anyways, guys, I don't know what's up with the gameplay. It's lagging like fucking shit. But anyway, um, so we, we, he was about to get out of his car and whatnot, and we got really scared. So, like, we started walking the other way. We just stopped talking. We started walking. He kept following us. And then we started running. We started running. I don't know why we did it. Make it more obvious that, like, we started going to get fucking raped. And, um, so we started running down this alley or down the neighborhood. And we ended up, you know, it was, pff, I, like, it's it's hard to explain because it happened such a long time ago. And I don't even want to fucking remember what happened because, like, it's, it's scary. Like, it's some scary shit. And, uh, as we're going down the alley, he comes down the alley and, like, says, stop and get in my car. Like, he literally said, get in my car. And I was like, what the fuck? I only just said it, but I was like, whoa. And I got all scared. I literally, my friend started crying. He's like, oh, please don't, please don't take me. Everything like that. He started crying. And I was just standing there like, oh, shit. You know, the innocent crayfish is just standing there. So, luckily, my parents' mom, well, my my friend's parents actually came down the alley because we knew they were, we always walked through there to get picked up because it was really cold. And as she came down the alley, the truck left. Because, you know, he wouldn't stay there. Somebody would, like, tell somebody that they're trying to, like, molest or some shit. And luckily, his mom saved us. And <clears throat> if it wasn't for that, I'd probably be, like, dead. Or I'd probably be getting raped right now in the butthole. And, uh, probably, like, would have been a slave. <laughs> if you guys think about it. But anyways, guys, I thought it was something to tell you guys. Something you guys should know about me and what I've experienced. It's not a great experience. Like, no one should remember that experience, but whatever. That's that. I hope everyone has a great rest of their Monday. Um, I actually have three weeks until I go on winter break, which is really, I'm really hyped. And during winter break, I'm going to be double uploading every single day. Literally every single day. And uh, so, yeah, be on the lookout for that. And, um, I am fucking cold as shit. So, if, like, if you hear my heavy heavy breathing, it's not because, like, I just ran a mile. It's just, it's fucking cold as hell. I'm gonna go fix that. But, if you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe if you are new. And it's been your boy, Velcray, and I'm out. Peace. Peace.